Everybody's always asking me how I do my winged eyeliner, so I thought I would show you guys one way to do it with eyeshadow and an angled brush, and one way to do it with liquid liner. I'm not wearing any makeup right now, I'm just trying to show you the technique. This is the brush I'm gonna use. It's very little, it's linked in my bio. So I always start from the middle of my eye, and then I just work my way out in kind of a straight line, like that. And then I go to the bottom, like, corner of my eye, I guess, and I just go just like that. And then I connect. Okay, so now I have this like short wing that I just filled in and then I'm just gonna go from the edge and just bring it out. Okay, see? That's the first little wing. And if it's looking too swoopy for me and I want it to be straighter, I just fill in the top a little bit. And it's eyeshadow, so it's easy to blend. This is the thing that I do for my everyday makeup, honestly, and it looks like this with like a full face of makeup, okay? So then you have liquid liner and I've tried so many different brands. I've tried so many different like types of brushes and everything. My favorite by far is the NYX Epic Ink Liner. It's not too dry and in my experience, the brush is the easiest to work with. Okay, so for this, I kind of start with the wing and then I work my way inward. So I will start drawing basically to this part right here where the eye starts curving down and I will just go out and I'll show you. Okay, literally it could be a sloppy line just like that. And then all I have to do is connect from this corner right here to the wing. And honestly, the higher the better. If you start it too low, it doesn't look very good. And then I just clean it up. Okay. And I feel like I have to whisper, I'm ever so careful with this part right here. Cause if it gets too thick, that's where things go sideways. <laughs> And honestly, sometimes I leave it like this, but then usually I'll bring it in like mostly into my eye. <laughs> and that's really how I like my liner to be for liquid liner. I like it to really stop right there where my corner is. But if you want it to be thicker, that's kind of all you have to do. <laughs> and this is usually how my liner ends up looking. Cause again, I have no makeup on right now, so I look crazy. But yeah, these are kind of the two different ways that I do it. Let me know which one you guys prefer and please tell me if you try out my method and if it works.